Hello there my purple banditos and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Black. I'm Purple Rodri. In the last episode we defeated Nat Green's gym leader Lenora and obtained the basic badge. Upon beating her, we heard some news that Team Plasma is running around doing some crazy stuff. So she ran upstairs and we're going to go ahead behind her and help her. We're actually right off the battle so we have only Roran left that hasn't fainted. So things are going to get pretty tricky here if all goes crazy. No you wait! Enough fooling around! So you come, Gym Leader! We Team Plasma claim this museum's Dragon Skull with the name of Pokemon Liberation! To show you what's serious, we'll steal it right before your eyes! Well then, here's our smoke screen! Plasma, Plasma! Wingardium Liviosa, it looks like, because the skull has disappeared! Oh, man, what is gonna happen? What's going on? Uh, well, we have to go after them. All right, let's go after them then because, you know, someone's not going to notice a dude holding a big Dragonite skull in the middle of the road. Good day, Lenora. Find any good fossils lately? This is a prize visit. Are you suffering from Mortis's block again? Rodri, this is Berg. He may not look like it, but he's Castelia City's gym leader. Ah! Just looking for a change of pace. Seems hectic or something around here. What's up? What's up? Someone just walked away with an exhibit. That's what's up. Oh, hi, Rodri. What's everybody doing here? Rodri, is there some kind of problem? And these two are your friends? Bianca and Sharon. Oh, I see. They're trainers. Okay, then. Let's split up and search. I'll head this way. Everyone, Sharon and Bianca, I want you to stay here at the museum. Berg and Rodri, you two search Pinwheel Forest. Got it? Berg, you show the way. I'm counting on you, everyone. Uh-huh. You're Rodri, is it? Are you raring to round up our robbers? Oh, oh, Rodri, take this with you. Fiddle gave me this dowsing machine to give you. she tell me, um, you can use the dowsing machine to find places where items are hidden, so you can find stuff you can't even see. For now, all we need to do is protect the museum, right? Hey, wait for me! Okay, looks like we have been given another mission, and this time we are going to be working with Berg, Castelia City's gym leader. Probably someone we're gonna have to battle in the future. Hey! How's it going? You smell really nice today. Did you did you get a new perfume or something? I heard, you know, they have some pretty good shops. Oh, okay, yeah, all right, that's fine. I'll, yeah, I'll call you another time, okay? Even though your phone number is missing a digit. All right, let's make our way back towards the left because that's where I saw Berg go and see what is in store for us. We have made it to Pinwheel Forest and it looks to me like here's Berg. This leads to Painwheel Forest. If they manage to scurry off into the forest, we might have trouble. All right, Berg, we'll be following you. And I'm a little bit nervous, but here we go. We have entered the forest, and Berg is just up ahead. Well, you say, there are two ways out of Painwheel Forest. The road that goes straight and the path that winds through the woods. I will take the straight road after them. If they're not there, I'll block the exit. Would you please take the other way and check whether Team Plasma is hiding in there somewhere? You'll run into a lot of trainers, but it's basically a single path, so I'm sure you won't get lost. Come on, let's do this for Lenora's sake. Alright, see you later, Berg. We are going to be going through the tough path. Of course, a lot of battles coming up, and it looks like we have our first one, so let's go ahead and do this. Alright, so there we go, easy does it, and it also looks like we have a Team Plasma grunt up ahead, so let's go ahead and battle them too. To 
too bad I haven't got anything. If you want to get it back, you're just gonna have to look for my associates. Alright, we're gonna have to look for more Team Plasma Grunt, which is great. There's one ahead. I am actually gonna switch uh, our floater up in front because Roran's up to level 21, gained a lot of XP. It's Floater's turn, and it looks like this one is a Lady Grunt, so let's go ahead and kick her butt too. Do I look like the kind of girl to carry a heavy load? Better try somewhere else. Okay, that was that was pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and use a repel so we can start running through these patches of grass because I don't know exactly which direction we have to head so we can try out a couple different ones. There is a Pokeball up here. I'm gonna go ahead and get it and I think I saw a one more, but let me see if I have to battle someone. If I have to battle someone, I prefer just to chill. All right, and there we go. We got this one as well and that is a big root. I wonder what that does. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it probably powers up moves or something. I don't know, that's usually what those weird, strangely named objects do. Oh no, there's a guy up here. I don't wanna battle you. How am I gonna skip you? How do I not battle you? Repel's effect wore off. Oh, yes, I made it past this guy, nice. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and use another repel then. Hey, good thing I bought like 10. I knew they would be coming in handy eventually. Uh, it, it's always, you know, it's always kind of tricky having to get these and it looks like there is a pokeball up here too so let me go ahead and get that one nice we found an antidote can we run through that log that is what it looks like to me and we have a battle Okay, so there we go, and this trainer is also giving us a Chesto Berry. I'll take the Chesto Berries. They've come in handy. They've always helped us. All right, let's keep going upstairs. I don't want to really run into those things. It seems like those things have trainers in them. And ah, oh, here's another one. All right, so there we go. We defeated that trainer, and that trainer also gave us a Pekka Berry. Uh, so you know what? By defeating them, at least we get berries, so we get some good use out of it. I am not bumping into that little thing over there. I do not want to battle that one. I'm going to go ahead and heal up too, because we just took quite a bit of damage in that battle. It was a tough one. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and heal up Floater. We have another Team Plasma Grunt up ahead. Oh, I just misclicked a potion. I'm going to put Roaring up in front, though. Let's mix it up a little bit. Let's get both of them in there. So let's put Roaring up in front, and let's take on this Team Plasma Grunt. Yeah, I'm here to buy time, and if you don't step lively, we're gonna get away. All right, we defeated that ground too. Let's head down this log then and continue where we need to go. Oh, look, here's another Pokeball. Let's get it, and that is a Paralysis Heal. Paralysis Heal, and there are more of these little clumpy green choo-choo looking things. I do not want to bump into these things. Ah, I feel like we're gonna have to, and yes, we have a battle. Okay, there we go. We defeated another trainer, obtained another Pekka Berry, and it looks like there is a log up ahead, which we should probably head down, and there is another Team Plasma Grunt, but something's happening here.
Fine, take your stupid skull. Hey, we got our skull back. Awesome, the big huge Dragonite skull, which I have no idea how we're carrying it around. So we're just like, you know, probably the size of the skull. So the dream our king had, the dream we had, will come true. How are you holding up, fellow subject of our king? Gorm of the Seven Sages! I'm mortified that the skull which we, we went to so much trouble to obtain was stolen from us so easily. It's not important. We can afford to abandon the Dragon Skull. According to the results of our research, this is not the legendary Pokemon for which Team Plasma is looking. It is completely unrelated. But we will not allow anyone to disrupt our plans and get away with it. We will fix it so you never interfere with us again. Oh, sweet! The bug Pokemon were getting all worked up, so here I come! And what do I spy with my little eye? This important looking guy! Are you here to help your friends, whom I defeated? Rodri Berg! The others didn't have anything! And who are you supposed to be? Is this guy the big boss? I am one of the seven sages of Team Plasma. Gets this, another of the seven sages will liberate Pokemon with words alone. The remainder of the Seven Sages have ordered their compatriots to take Pokemon with full force, but the odds are a little against us now. To you, the bug Pokemon user Berg, and the normal Pokemon user Lenora, I say, know your enemies, know yourself, and you need not fear the result of a hundred battles. This time, we shall retreat quietly. To secure the liberation of Pokemon, we will steal Pokemon from trainers. Even though you are gym leaders, we will not tolerate any further obstruction from you. In any case, we will settle this someday. I hope you are looking forward to that time as much as I. There are Speedy Bunch! What are you planning to do, Burke? Are you going to chase them? Hmm. We got back the stolen skull, and if we quarter them, there's no telling what they might do. I think I'll be heading back, Lenora. Well, now, well... I'll be waiting for your challenge at Castelia City's Pokemon Gym. Yes, indeed. I'm certainly looking forward to it. See you later, Berg. Rodri, you're holding the Dragon Skull. You worked so hard to get back, right? All right, it looks like we gave the skull to Lenora. You know, and she that's her gym. Let her have it. Rodri, thank you so much. With a kind trainer like you taking care of him, the Pokemon with you must be happy. Here's a token of my gratitude. Please use it carefully. We obtained a Moonstone. Not gonna come in too handy, but hey, we'll take it. This is a Moonstone! Some Pokemon evolve when you use this item on them. Now I must take the Dragon Skull back to the museum. See you, take care of yourself. See you later, Lenora. Until we meet again. Uh, whenever that might be. Let's follow down here. I think the exit is this way. We have also bumped into a Miracle Seed. And let's just keep going onwards. Because who knows what awaits for us in the next town. Things are about to get crazy. And I have a feeling that a lot of stuff is coming for us very, very soon. And woo, look at this nice looking bridge. I think this is a good place to end things off for today. So if you guys have any tips on the events coming up, let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye. I wonder how I'm gonna cross that bridge. I hope they have taxis.